So y'all, we headed to Mexico. We are in an Uber right now and we are on the way to the airport. We got to the airport about like 5.30 in the morning and our flight was at 7. And of course we got some breakfast as soon as we got to the airport because we were hungry and yeah. We made it to Mexico. Now let's get this party started. I can't wait to tell y'all all the details about it. Make sure you like, subscribe, and comment. Thank you. So of course the first thing we did was get shots. What Jason be doing right Do it. No. Look. Thursday straight. Babe, look. We love you, Jason. Love you, Lauren. I forgot to get a video of our room, but the rooms were really, really oh, nice. Shit. Uh, 10 out of 10 for an all inclusive resort. Now we just at the sexy pool party, y'all. 10 out of 10. The party is super duper lit. Like the hookah, the pool, like the party just super lit. Only thing, like I said, the drinks are horrible. I drink top shelf liquor. Um, they only had like Jose Cuevo, 1800. But of course, you know, that's what you get in all of this resort. So of course, I'm gonna rate that part a zero out of 10. But other than that, topless um, pool parties. So you walking around and all you see is the women were beautiful everything was lit like i'm not gonna lie the sexy pool party 10 out of 10 so if you want to go to sensation island and you're looking for like stuff like that you go it is a swinger resort so that is the only thing like you're gonna get swinger vibes but we're not swingers so it wasn't more so of our vibe but it was cool it was still really fun except like i said And one thing about it, you could get as much liquor as you want. You might be throwing up, but you can get as much as you want. We took so many shots, y'all. We were so lit, like, he ended up throwing up. But I knew my limit because we was drinking 1800. That was like the best liquor they had. So I didn't do too, too, too much, but I drank enough to where I feel good. Take the 
we got the hood. We can't take the hood out the new. Babe. Good morning, you guys. So we're on day two. Uh, last night didn't end that well. We went to sleep about six. So we're gonna try again today. Bro. So this is one of the restaurants. Um, this was like the buffet part where they had like the breakfast or whatever. We didn't try a lot of restaurants, I'm not gonna lie, because I'm a picky eater. So but I will rate this, um, I would say like a four out of 10. The best thing they had was the bacon. They had um, French toast, they had pancakes, they had eggs, fruit, and stuff like that. So I would give it a four out of 10. This is not what we eat at home, but we on vacation, so you know the food is not gonna be that great. Y'all, so I'm looking how I feel. We just got back from the sexy pool, and Look, I'll be just tired. Like, hair fucked up. Like, everything. Now we're about to get ready for dinner. And. Mm -hmm. That's true. Oh, this one. But yeah. We're about to get ready for dinner. And then we're going to go to the phone party. I'm going to try to sneak some videos and pictures for y'all. But right now, just lit. Now this was the phone party. Phone party 10 out of 10. You know we can't record like that because people are walking around. So but 10 out of 10. So y'all we back up and at it on day three and it's raining. It is raining. We're going to get breakfast and yeah, and leaving me because my dress is I can't walk fast. Huh? So the rain has stopped. We are about to walk the beach. Um, yeah. So we decided to play whatever. Cornhole. Cornhole. Ah! Real bad, too. Yeah. I give you five hundred dollars. Five hundred. All right. All right. It's a nice pool. Papa is currently tired <laughs> and wants to take a nap. One thing I do like about my vacation partner, he likes the nap. So we're gonna get us a nap. <laughs> <laughs> For sure. <laughs> Welcome to. Welcome to the Vans channel, Mr. and Mrs. Dan. Mrs. Are... Need her hair done. <laughs> You don't want to talk about it. Here. <laughs> you know, fuck. It's like, what I need my hand. I just got my shit in. So, because you gotta spray my eyes on, I'm gonna make my stuff. Need some rain, man. I'm not partially good without weed, though. Yeah, you've been doing great. Okay, I'm ready to get home. Gotta go. You ready to go? Hell yeah. You tired? Ready to go home, make a baby. She getting her birth control. I'm so happy. <laughs> I'm going to leave her when she had a baby. <laughs> Why would you say that? Just like niggas. That's what niggas do. They leave out the kid. Are you going to be a good father? Yeah. We about to go ATV in. Um, I'm going to try to record. I can have my phone. Mm -hmm. Yep. So we got some shots before we went to go ATV. ATV was really fun. I highly recommend you going to Mexico. 10 out of 10. Come on. Um, yeah. We had to go to this little store because I was rushing and I forgot my shoes. So he got me some, I guess, little swimming shoes or whatever to ATV in. They were comfortable, so I do recommend those as well. And now let's get into the ATV part. It's $44.
fire. <laughs> it's hot now. Come on. I'm ready to go. God damn. So we are AC. Yeah, my boy, he got new boy. What's up? Hey, what's up to my YouTube? So we had to go to the jungle to ATV zip line and uh, do the cenote. It was about 30 minutes away from our room. Uh, of course, we had to check in. So this is where we're going right now. It was really nice. I really loved the jungle scenes. We stayed out there for about four hours. So I would recommend to anyone that's going to Alana. Where we go to? We're ATV and we're about to I don't know. I'm going to Down, lean back, and when I scream out, let go. You have to let go and fall off into the water straight down into the Right? Very important. If you're doing the sink line, do not go with your sunglasses. One of the stores where we went ATV in at. It was really nice, really cultural. Like, I really enjoyed that. And y'all, but when we got on this thing, this man was driving so fast. Like, he had somewhere to be. Like, it was so fast. Oh, no. There you go. Look here, pose for the gram. Yeah, pose for the gram. Yeah. Now, when I say let go, let go and fall off. Okay. Squat down, lean back, bend your knees up. Let go. Yeah. Well done. Like you feel already, did you? Yeah. Do it. You got two lifeguards. The main one. Okay. Is it good? We'll go to the very last one. Walk down to the last one. Don't let go too early. I think. I will say to you when you're not here. Alright. Oh my god. One more step down. Look here. Big smell. Yeah, there you go, Eddie. What? Y'all, I was so scared going into the Sonote. Like, oh my god. <laughs> I really thought I died. Now we headed back to the room Ooh. from the oh zip lining, the ATV, and the cenote. Headed to dinner. The food was still trash. It was a zero out of ten. But this place had like steak and stuff. And we're not really good. We're still good. We are heading home and we want to rate Temptation Island a 7 out of 10. It was cool, food was gross, liquor was gross. We met some nice people. Shout out to them. Now it's time to go. My foot here fucked up. I would definitely go back for the experience if you've never been. Would I go back personally? No, I would yes. not go back. Thank you. Um, See you next week. But Make sure you subscribe, like, and comment. Thank you guys for tuning in. I hope you guys enjoyed our video.